All right, so here's the deal. Jana and I were talking about going out for a nice steak dinner, but what we're gonna do instead is go to Ponderosa. We're gonna let you know how this goes. Ponderosa Steakhouse and Bonanza Steakhouse yeah. are two different brands of the same company mm -hmm. and are really the same exact thing. It's just named one or the other depending on where So you're just basically saying Bonanza was the show and the Ponderosa is where the, 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 the name the, of the ranch was. That's exactly right. Ah, yes. see? Yes. Oh, see? You are smart. Yes. Ponderosa is where we're going to eat num nums and hopefully have diarrhea. Oh, well, I don't know. But hopefully we're, not have diarrhea. Well, yeah, you never know. We can lose a couple pounds, right? Yeah. Oh, look, I look. I can you some, lose some water weight. Oh, yeah. Dinner for... Dinner buffet, twelve ninety nine. Dinner buffet, twelve ninety nine. So it's, it's economical. Yes. And yes. There's, there's somewhat of a crowd, but it doesn't seem too. You gotta understand, we're eating at five o'clock. Overly so crowded. Yeah, it is five eighteen. We right? are the old people crowd. Three. Oh no, I'm doing what? it back because he gets my stain, yo. Don't show off your stain. I got. I'm gonna show off my butter, <laughs> my butter stain. That's evidence. <laughs> it's my butter stain. Okay, here we go. All right. All right. But I'm but I'm but I'm down upon the road. So, bland food. Yes, tasteless food. Yup, yup, yup. Mmm, in our gut. Ponderosa. Okay. So, after that intro, what are your thoughts? My thoughts are that. The restaurant was clean. Yay! Service was very good. Yay! Very friendly people working there. Zero complaints about any of that. Mm -hmm. In fact, I would go so far as to say that the food is definitely not bad. No. Not I bad at worse. all. Yeah. yeah. Way worse. Way worse. But it's lacking one key ingredient. <gasps> Taste. Taste. Season. It lasts, lacks... It lacks the taste. It lactates and taste. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> lactation would have more flavor. You're probably right. Yeah. Yeah. Um, can't use that. Oh, the cafeteria food at the hospital is actually better. It actually has more of a flavor. Hmm. Um, it reminds me of like when you're in the hospital and you're on a cardiac diet and you can't have anything with taste. Yeah. Um, well, let's look at the positives. Oh, very clean. Yep. Very friendly people. Yes. Good service. Yeah. Cleaner. I would say overall a better experience than I expected. Very much so. Certainly not bad by no. any means. Mm -mm. The steak was prepared correctly. Yes. Uh, salad bar was good. Salad bar was rocking. Yeah. yeah buddy. Lots of stuff. You like chickpeas, mm -hmm. cheese, you like the little ham bits, you know, that deal. Yeah. It's all there right for, for the taking. But yeah, just the steak. Not a whole lot of flavor mm -mm. and uh, kind of tough. Baked potato. Mm. Yeah. Nothing. I mean, a uh, baked potato is baked potato, but I've had better flavors in from a baked potato. That's true. Um, when your baked potato is just like, hey, it's like the same kind of baked potato you can get from Wendy's. that have been sitting out for two hours. That's true. That's true. It's okay, but it's not like I'm gonna be like, damn, I want that baked potato. Right. Give me that tater. Give me that tater. I want that tater with oh. sour cream. Butter. Mm. Butter. No. Diabetes. Ooh, diabetes. Okay, now, honestly, when we went through the line and everything, everything was very clean. Um, there wasn't, like, a lot of food mixed in with other food. Everybody was being, like, really good as far as getting new plates and going up there. Mm -hmm. um, but every time that if we did get something, I did get one small other plate after my salad. I definitely had to add some salt and I definitely had to add pepper and I'm not one to add a lot of salt to things, but when I have to really season it to, for it to, to give it a flavor, uh, um, if you're an older person, when your taste buds maybe are lacking, let's say golden buckeye age, maybe you, it's probably one of your top 
10 places you want to eat. If you're an ARP member, yeah, that place is banging yep. and just a baller value. Yeah, actually, actually, honestly, for what you paid for it, it is a good value. For Gemini, not so much because we can't eat a whole lot. Yeah, we both had gastric bypass. Can't tell by looking at this, though. Yeah. I didn't take. We're like two bluefish. But um, when I feel that we could spend that same kind of money and like go to Texas Roadhouse and get something with better flavor. Right. And we're good. Yeah. Um. Yeah. It wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Mm -hmm. It wasn't as memorable as I thought it would be. I mean, I enjoyed my company. No. He's, he's always a great date. Well, thank you. That's You're kind welcome. of you to say. You know, one thing, speaking of dates, one thing that we did notice there yes. were... The creepy old men? There were... Well, I mean, creepy is a, uh, you know... It's a strong term. That's a strong term. I get it. But there were a number of... Elderly older gentlemen men, men eating by themselves. themselves in there. So maybe it's um it's a good place to go. Maybe if her granny needs a date, if you know what I mean, or yeah, maybe get her. Yeah. You know, if you if you belong to farmers only, Ooh. and you want to get into the city a little bit yes. for a for a for an evening, mm -hmm. you might want to check out the Ponderosa. <gasps> it's also a popular place for truck drivers. Have you noticed that? I did notice that. Oh yeah. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. I guess even truck drivers need their meat. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. It wasn't bad. It wasn't horrible. Would we go again? Mm. We probably won't go out of our way to go again. But if somebody else likes it and wants to enjoy it and has never experienced the Ponderosa, we'd be more than happy to take you there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're going to pay. We're not buying it for you. No. Right. But we'll go with you. That's correct. Yeah. Now, we did not have the desserts, though. No, we didn't. Um, they did have sugar-free jello that did look like the hospital. Mm -hmm. Um, They had some cookies. And they had some questionable pudding, which did also remind me of the hospital. Mm -hmm. Um, But they had an ice cream machine. Hey, at least it worked, unlike McDonald's. Right. So at least you were going to get your ice cream full of it. But um, it wasn't too horrible like i said um out of a total of four thumbs i think i'd give it two i'd give it i'd give it one and a half oh you only give it one and a half i give it you know try to be give fair. like one and a nuck yeah yeah one and a nuck yeah okay a one I gotcha. and a nuck. okay one and a nuck. all right all right so this is jim and jana forgot to introduce ourselves earlier yeah better late than never and uh we hope you enjoyed our special report for the Snack Network. Yep. A restaurant review edition. Bum, bum, bum. Don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. We will be back.